Minecrafters, grab your pickaxes and catch up on the Cube Quarterly. What's up guys, update just dropped. It sure is something to try and decipher, huh? We've got pages of new stuff to go over, so let me learn you a thing about all the events and mishaps that happened on the server this week. Party in the Toxic Cave. That's a very safe place to have no protective equipment whatsoever. A safer place is the brand new playground. Mozzarella opens up a playground for creatures and carers to play in, complete with a treehouse and conveyor belt roller coaster. The roller coaster is 100% safe and child tested. The Void Sanctum held its initiation ceremony, welcoming Brie, Gem, Soup, Bomb Bomb, Jinx, and Pip into its folds. Experience the Void. Following that was a white baby attack. The baby has learned some new moves, with swarms of nightmare stalkers still in its arsenal It uses a cloud of slideshow. At least, slideshows for those of us with lower-end PCs who have particles turned on. The news, while produced on a PC older than Five Nights at Freddy's, has particles off. Get on my level, scrubs. The folks who hit the baby with 600 plus laceration get a pass because you don't need frames when you have massive blood loss. Next up, a series of screenshots all captioned the cutest baby on the server, none of which feature the same creature twice. Yes, these creatures are all very cute and baby, but to make claims like that, we'll have to have a proper creature pageant. Everyone go catch up on toddlers and tiaras. New builds pop up around the server with many players building new and adventurous structures. Slanted roofs, windmills and towers, not my cabbages. Unlike most architectural ventures, the people here think about wheelchair users when making bathrooms. This one is big enough for any power chair to fit. The void begins to encroach from people's homes, though not through the sanctum this time. Despite a tiny render distance enforced, chunk loading with an average of 50 players is difficult. A community barbecue was held. Plenty of food and drinks and plenty of fun games. Of course, a party can only hold off the angst for so long. Hema and Snowball make some devoted sacrifices. After this, Snowball celebrates a birthday, a lighthearted end to a long day. Another white baby attack. These are becoming routine on the server, something that is horrifying when you think about it. Violent attacks by a seemingly immortal creature are normalizing. Christ alive. Residents have different ways of de-stressing after these attacks. Hanging out on roofs is a popular one. Deep sea exploration sees an explosion of interest. Submersibles and whales and dive suits abound. Fancy clothes and gourmet foods are made, including some questionable rich folk eats. A picnic is held at the pergola, attending bond over food in a lovely sunny day. And now, the artistic Minecraft behaviors. A beautiful little bakery opens up. Sweet treats abound here, and of course, more base work from the residents. Some bases are incredibly ambitious, and all are beautiful. All bases. Yep. All of them. All bases. Guys, please, this is just the back rooms now. The broadcast has to end here.